Well, a wildfire south of Boulder, Colorado this weekend forced thousands to flee. It's now at least 20 percent contained and evacuation orders have been lifted. In an alarming outlook, the National Weather Service said this month a drought extends across more than 60 percent of the country. That's fuel for more fire. We get now more from Michael Abeda of our Denver station KCNC. For the second time in three months, a wildfire in Boulder County, Colorado, threatened hundreds of homes, forcing thousands to find safety. I was like, this looks like a wildfire um, brewing, so we should get off this mountain. Ben Holden was hiking Saturday just west of the city when he came a couple hundred yards from the flames. The flames were first reported Saturday afternoon. Dry, windy conditions spread it quickly towards the city. We were within probably a thousand yards of, to getting to the homes on the west end of Boulder. Just three months ago, the Marshall Fire ripped through two bedroom communities on the east side of Boulder, burning more than 1,000 homes. Two people were killed. Boulder County Emergency Management says lessons learned from that fire helped them fight this one and evacuate people quickly. We have resources from all over the front range coming in and working on this. 200 firefighters from 30 agencies fought the flames. This fire has burned more than 200 acres, but no homes have been harmed and no injuries reported. Good planning, good prep, and a lot of good mitigation work are the reasons that we had good success today. Firefighters say these days, fire season in Colorado is year round. I think this is just a sign of the th way things are going to go. Firefighters are hoping that they can keep the fire pushed up against the rocky and snowy foothills and away from the city. Jerika, Michael Abeda, thank you.